Hello everyone, once again welcome back to another session. Today we are gonna configure traffic shipping rules in our security appliance MX from Cisco Miraki dashboard. In this instance we are going to configure traffic shipping rules for the device on the LAN side of the MX. These traffic shipping rules will apply to all the client passing traffic through the MX. Now we are in Cisco Miraki dashboard to configure traffic shipping rules. We go to security and SD1 and SD1 and traffic shipping. Create a new rule and select traffic ship you would like to limit. In the scenario, we will select four type of traffic. We are going to go down. So we can see the different traffic shipping option. Here we are going to use create a rule. We have four different applications to create. First one, we will be at database and cloud service. Here you can mention a specific one. I will select all database and cloud service. The limit will be 5 Mbps. If you want to make less, you can scroll down. Or if you want to increase more, you need to click details and you can specify. So here I will assign 5 Mbps. Other application going to be social web and photo sharing. Then create add a new shipping rule. Click add and select social web and photo sharing. And here select all social web and photo sharing. If you want to specify, you can specify specific social media so here i'm selecting all social web and photo sharing then the bandwidth limit i'm giving here to will be add another new shipping rule that will be for video and music all video and music the limit is two we're gonna create new shipping rule then click add here we're gonna Shaping rule for VIP and video conferencing. All VIP and video conferencing. Then I'm giving limit for where 10 Mbps, 10,000 to 40 download, and the upload 10,000 to 40 Kbps. So right now we have four different traffic shaping rule. This is gonna be applied to all the devices in the LAN side of the security appliance finalize this configuration just has to save the changes and that's how you configure the traffic shipping rules in Cisco Miraki dashboard one important note the configuration we did it's completely default so that is you gonna be applied to all the VLANs that you have to specify the individual VLANs you need group policy and need to attach the group policy in my next video i will show how you can create group policy and how you can attach the group policy thank you so much have a nice day bye bye